Good morning, guys. <laughs> There's no way I just caught that on camera. Anyway, good morning, guys. It is 11.01 on Thursday, April 1st, aka April Fool's Day. Today, I'm going to be filming another day in my life college vlog for you guys. I am going with my friend Cameron, and we're gonna do some photo shoots around downtown Tampa. And then we both have class at four. So I think for this shoot, I'm gonna curl my hair or curl the bottom of it at least because all the pictures on my Instagram have straight hair. So once I'm curling there, honestly, my hair is naturally curly, but does my Instagram ever see that? No, it's not the pretty curls. If any of you guys watching have really good curl products that work for you guys, please hit me up because I have yet to find mine. I decided that I'm gonna make the muffins before I start getting ready because it probably makes more sense to make breakfast first, something that I literally never do because I barely ever eat breakfast. So we're gonna do that today. So this is the mix, Betty Crocker muffin mix. It is the easiest thing to make, it's foolproof. I would know because I can't cook. Three steps, um, you guys are gonna make it with me. This has somehow turned into a cooking show. Okay, so first you preheat the oven to 400, so I'm gonna do that right now. Okay, so all you do is you put the mix, oh. <laughs> I hate myself. Okay, so don't be an idiot like me and open the bag with caution. Okay, let's try this again. <laughs> I'm going to pour this into the bowl. We add a half cup of water or milk, but I'm gonna do water. Now we just bake it from 16 to 21 minutes. Okay, now I'm gonna get ready, but I'm not gonna film myself getting ready. I'm just gonna charge my battery in the meantime, but yeah, I'll be right back. Okay, so it took forever to get ready and I finished up. The muffins were done. They came out more like <laughs> muffin cake. But anyway, I'm here at Strauss Hall waiting for a camera to come out. Uh, this is currently the fit. Okay, you can't see it anyway. I brought like three outfits, so we're probably gonna try and get a bunch of different pictures, but oh my God, it looks like it's gonna rain. Well, yeah, that's where we're at right now. I'm just waiting for Cameron to come out and then we're gonna go head downtown and take some pictures. So, see you there. We're here at the first location, random parking garage. We love to see it. We just took a ton of pictures. Here's Cammy. <laughs> we took the pictures here, downtown, fun times, cause come on, look at this. She's beautiful. That skyline, yeah. Keep going, keep going. Okay, that's good. Okay, ready? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay, now that we've taken 7,000 photos here, we're gonna try another location. We're gonna go on the street. That's a cool sign, you'll see. <laughs> okay guys, quick outfit change. Just changed in the back of my car, we love that. I'll show you the fit. I just got it. This fun tennis skirt from Amazon. It's really cheap. The lighting is so bad. And then we have these Converse. <laughs> it's the new style. I don't know what it's called, but it's like a platform. We're at location two, the Tampa sign, the Tampa theater. Okay guys, I just dropped Cameron off back home. We got some adorable pictures. We went to two different locations. We were gonna go to more, but it's just too windy today and probably gonna start raining soon, so. It was a really good day. I'm really excited that we did that. I definitely wanna do that more often just because there are so many cute places in Tampa if you just drive around and look. If you're in the Tampa area, I definitely recommend just grabbing a couple of different outfits, taking your friends, and going for some photo shoots because that was a lot of fun. Other than the crazy wind. So that is all for today. I know this was a quick video, but I hope you guys enjoyed coming along with me and I am so beyond excited because I am going to Jupiter Beach with a couple of friends next weekend. So I'm going to have so much vlog content for you guys and pictures and all that fun stuff. If you don't know what Jupiter Beach is, it's where the famous Instagrammer Anna Stonewell, I don't know if she lives there, but yeah, I'm so beyond excited to take you guys with me. Stay tuned for next week. I 
I don't know how long it might take to edit. It'll be in the near future, but please continue to reach out and DM me any questions you have about the Tampa area or just any questions in general, any videos you'd like to see. Also, don't forget, I do live in New York in the summer and the winter. If there's any New York or New York City content you want to see this summer, let me know and I will do that for you guys. So thank you guys again. I hope you enjoyed this video and I will see you next week. Bye!